Welcome back, boys and girls. I'm your boy, Channel Rings 918, and today um, it's something different. There's, it is around gaming, but it's it's not a game. It's not, you know, it's a controller. Uh, as you can see in the top left, it says introducing the Xbox Adaptive Controller. Um, this is something I've never thought about and I've never wondered about until I saw this. Um, until I saw the idea of this and heard about this. Basically, obviously, as a gamer, you, you play with, you know, mouse and keyboard or a controller. Um, but there are obviously some people in the world who can't use the two hands or has problems using a hand or have problems that cause them not be able to grip stuff. Um, so this is where the Xbox adaptive controller comes in. Um, we're going to watch the trailer and then I'll talk a bit more about it. But if you like this video, guys, please hit that like and subscribe button. This, what I've seen of this, it looks amazing. So let's hope it stays amazing. Let's hope it does that. So let's just watch the trailer, shall we? At Xbox, we have a controller design that our fans love. However, for gamers with limited mobility, or gamers who don't use both their hands, this controller design might not work best for them. <laughs> Doorknobs are the worst thing ever invented. That's gotta be awkward. The cell phones that I use, these are the sorts of things that we don't think about until we have to. And I think about them every day. I have cerebral palsy on my entire right side. This side of the controller is fine. This side doesn't. <sighs> That's gotta be horrible for people. That has to be so hard to do everyday life stuff. The controllers have gotten more sophisticated, and it started to get really frustrating. Jeez. We designed the Xbox Adaptive Controller through feedback from the accessibility community. Look at, like, look at this lady. Like, I'm gonna pause it here. Sorry. But like this. <sighs> This lady finds it must be a great love gaming, but finds it hard to use a controller when this obviously lets you play. This is amazing. This is absolutely incredible technology. With the Xbox Adaptive Controller, a gamer can game with one hand and one foot, or one hand and their shoulder, or even one foot and their chin. And I can change it from game to game. It's amazing. Hospital is I just, a I just, for patients who've either had a spinal cord injury or a traumatic brain injury, and it's placed for their rehab. Yeah. We're here at game night, and we're helping new patients uh, getting back into gaming again. Look at that. Is that the D-pad? Yeah. yeah. Our role as occupational therapists is to get people back to doing. When the Xbox yes. the controller came along, it acted like an Xbox controller, and it just worked. Uh-oh. It's such amazing, like, rehab use and everything. Cory and his brother Zachary are twins. Before Cory's injury, Zachary had gamed with him regularly, and that was the way that they related to each other as siblings. It, it, bringing families back. This is amazing. The Xbox Adaptive Controller and the Co-Pilot feature allowed them again to play games together. So there's a huge social component to it. You got that. Yes, yes. They can play any game they want. I see the confidence just burst out of them. There we go. There's, there it is. Um, wow. Just, just wow. Um... When you game, you don't think about other people. You don't you don't think about the person, people you're against, and the problems they could be going through every day. Um, you just think they're playing the same controller. You as, as this shows, kids, people don't have hands or can't have full function hands. So it is a great thing that Xbox, Microsoft have gone out of their way to create this to create this controller um as you saw there it was helping so many people not just connect back with gaming but helping with recovery with spinal injuries helping people be able to be more social with their families again this is just <laughs> this is an incredible device and i'm hoping that people it will help so many people so i'm really hoping it does that 
Microsoft has done an amazing job here, and I hope to God it works well. Um, but yeah, that was the trailer, guys. Something quick and easy, something amazing. Um, go and give it some love. If you see it on Twitter, or if you see it on Facebook, or if you see it on, you know, whatever, share it, comment. Do whatever it can to get this out there, because this needs to be brought out, Like especially from a gaming community that we are, or that I am anyway, I'm part of. It'll be great to see more people who being able to game again or even game for the first time. Um, but yeah, anyway, we'll end that there. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. As always, tune in, like and subscribe, and comment for me. That would be awesome. But thank you very much, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day.